Butterflies are free to fly. Fly away. High away. Hey. Hey. Huh? Glad to see you. Want to talk about mono meals. For example, taking a whole big bushel of kale, pounding it down into the blender, blending it up with water. Bam. That's it. One o'clock. That's going to be your meal. See, when you do a mono meal, it's much easier on the digestive system. That's the reason for it. Four o'clock, 4.30, gonna go for another meal. You pound down a bunch of dandelion. Fantastic for the liver. A lot of dandelion with some water. Blend it, pound it down. It's a mono meal. Now, if you want to, you can mix uh, like dandelion, lemon, and papaya. About three of them in there, but you don't want to be going to five and seven different types of things. That's what I used to do. Uh, it was a mistake. <laughs> so it's better for your digestive system if you do one meal at a time or one to three things. Okay. Um, if you're a bodybuilder, you're definitely going to want protein, of course, and durian. Durian is what you're going to want to eat for that. Eat a lot of it. Don't eat a little bit, eat a lot of it. You're not gonna get fat on this. So durian is what you're gonna wanna get. And get rid of salt as best you can. Salt is salt and it's gonna bloat you no matter what. Now, you're gonna need that mineral in your body, which but you should be getting enough of that mineral by eating celery. Now, if you need more than that, for example, you wanna sprinkle it on some uh, corn pasta or whatever it is, you can use Celtic sea salt. Stop drinking water in plastic bottles. Now, everybody knows that, right? But they don't know when they go to the supermarket and they put their fresh fruits inside the supermarket and they smell the bag and say, oh my goodness, very, very powerful, right? That is bleeding into the food. That's very toxic. So watch for that. You're gonna wanna eat watermelon, not seedless. You want to eat it with the seeds. The seeds have very powerful stuff in them. Remember, watermelon is a very fast-moving food. It'll go right through your intestines really quick. So you don't want to be eating it at 3 o'clock when you just finished eating some potatoes or something like this. You don't want to be doing that because it's very fast and they're going to bump into each other. So eat early on in the morning. Seedless type are generically modified. So get, get the kind with the seeds in it. Get some sunlight. Uh, now, it's not going to cause melanoma, you know. Uh, sunlight kills fungus. Sunlight kills mold. And sunlight kills yeast, in fact. Uh, people who get melanoma are usually toxic. Their liver is clogged. And their third kidney, if you will, uh, pumps a lot of blood through the skin to push out all of the toxins that the liver is having a hard time with, thus baking it with sun and gets trapped in the middle of your skin and years and years and years later you end up with melanoma and you wonder why. You know, don't use sunscreen because as I told you, the sun is not the problem. Don't use sunscreen because you're going to be baking and basting all of those chemicals that are in that sunscreen into your skin. You want nice skin, right? All right. Uh, eat aloe vera, in fact. Eat it. Eat aloe vera. It's nature's edible sunscreen. Now, uh, right about uh, 4.30 at night should be your last greens meal. No more greens after 4.30. Don't eat any more past 7 o'clock. And right about 6.30 should be your last meal. And it's not ideal, but for the real world type of person who uh, eating greens is just not enough for them. And for the real world people I'm talking about now, not the hardcore raw foodist, but you know, this is a happy medium that we're trying to do here. Eat corn pasta. Eat corn pasta made of corn. Eat corn pasta and uh, use ragu sauce with um, ragu with meat sauce, it is, because it's very low in sodium. You want to keep the sodium down. All right, that's a little baby tip, right? Sounds good. You could use some of those. It's a good idea. Try it out. You'll see what I mean. Do it three days in the beginning of the week or every other day if you want. But try the mono meal. 
definitely pound down some durian for protein. Okay, get rid of a lot of the salts. If you're gonna eat the salts, then you eat the Celtic sea salt. You know, again, watch out for those plastic bags. Watermelon's fantastic. Stay away from the sunscreen and uh, eat only up till seven o'clock at night. And uh, after that, just water. And no more greens after 4.30, okay? All right. Mm -hmm.